Turing machine for unary adder. Now let us go for the solution. Now we will consider two numbers 5 plus 2. The unary equivalent of 5 is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. The unary equivalent of 2 is 1, 2. Now we have to add these two and we have to find the result. 5 plus 2 is 1. Now we will use this Turing machine or we we'll, we are going to design a Turing machine to add these numbers. In the tape I have the series as first blank spaces and then this 5. Then I will have a delimiter for the separation of these two numbers and then I will have the second one 1, 2 and the remaining all will be the blank spaces. Okay, now I will have my tape header here. I will have my tape header here and in the beginning my tape header when it encounters a 1 it starts moving right. It starts moving right. It encounters <coughs> any number of 1's. So when it comes across 1, 1 is kept as it. Once it comes across a 0 which is the delimiter, this 0 is replaced by 1. This 0 is replaced by 1. So now I will have my string like this. This one and then this two and the blank spaces. Now my tape header is here. After replacing 0 by 1, it starts moving right. So when it come across 1, these 1's are kept as such and it moves and when it encounters a blank space, it starts moving left. It starts moving left. Now when it starts moving left, when it encounters a 1, this 1 is replaced by blank. This one is replaced by blank. Now I will have my string like this. So now I have my tape header here. I have my tape header here. So when I move upon, I can move the left till I reach the blank space where I have my series like this. All these are blank spaces and I have the result like this. Here all blank spaces. So when I see what is the result I get is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So 7 which is the binary unary equivalent. Now we are going to design a Turing machine for this. Always Q0 is the initial state. Q0 is the initial state. Now in the initial state my tape header can encounter any number of 1's until it encounters a 0. So until it encounters a 0 all the 1's are remained as 1's. So when it comes across how many 1's it might be it is kept as such and it moves right. Now when it encounters a 0 this 0 is replaced as 1 and it moves right and it moves right. Now this is the next state. Now in this state after replacing this 0 by 1 it may come across any number of 1's. So it may come across any number of 1's that 1's are replaced as 1's that it moves right. Okay now. At the last, when it comes across a blank space, when it encounters a blank space, this blank space is kept as such and it starts moving left. So when it encounters a blank space, it is kept as such and it starts moving left. So this is my Q2. Now after this, when it encounters, after this blank space, when it encounters a 1, this one is now replaced as blank and it starts moving left and it starts moving left until it reaches the blank space until it reaches the blank space now when it reaches the blank space you have you when you come across you will have all ones which is your answer okay so this is the required state where you will come across your answer